I know you're like, what? You got hot sauce as a birthday gift? I did. And I was like, oh, this girl knows me. Like she knows me. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Lashara Simone and today I'm doing a birthday haul. Okay, so my birthday was a month ago. It was November 30th. I am a Sagittarius. Um, but I'm filming this video late because some of my friends got my gifts to me a little bit late, which is totally fine, but I didn't want to film and not include what they got for me as well. So I held off for a bit and now we're ready to get into it. I got some really cool gifts for my birthday. Like this year was impressive. Now you're going to see some of these gifts and think they're a little bit weird, but I'll explain. Um, everything that I got is so perfect for me. It was amazing. Just a disclaimer, if you hear any background noise, I have some neighbors that are like moving out or moving in. I'm not really sure. They're making a little bit of noise. So if you hear anything, really sorry. Without any further ado, let's get started. Okay, so first up is going to be Heather. Heather is one of my best friends and she really, really, really showed up this year. She got me five birthday gifts. They were all so perfect. Um, so first things first, I can't show you right now. I'll show you the box. She got me a ring light. I can't show you because I'm using it right now. I absolutely love this ring light. It's amazing. Um, I would always try to like film during the day to get really good daylight. Um, today I did miss the sun and now that I have this ring light, I don't really have to worry about it. Um, so she got me a ring light. I believe it's a 10 inch, um, dimmable ring light. It comes with a remote, which is really nice. Um, I haven't used that yet though. In this little stand here, which I also haven't figured out how to use just yet, this is my first time I'm um, using this ring light. So I still have some things to figure out, but I'm really excited. You know, as a YouTuber, a ring light is essential. So now I got my ring light. Okay, so the next gift I got from Heather is this flash drive. <sighs> she really got me with this one okay so i was constantly complaining to her heather and i speak literally every day and i was constantly complaining about how i run out of space on my phone because i film for youtube on my phone and clearly i'm filming for a while i have to put up youtube videos so it takes up space and i already had like over nine thousand photos and videos on my phone please don't judge me but <laughs> I ran out of space and my phone is 256 gigabytes. So she was like, what the heck? You ran out of 256 gigs? I'm like, yeah, I take a lot of pictures. <laughs> but, um, so I was like trying to figure out what to do to get everything off my phone so I can clear space. And the whole time she's like giving me ideas, but secretly she knew she bought this for me. And when I got it in the mail, I literally screamed like, this is so perfect. So you can connect it directly into your phone. Um, and there's also like a USB for your computer or whatever else um, i'll take it out and show you guys i actually used it already i transferred all of my photos and videos from my phone onto this little um flash drive it's like that and then so you can open it this way and you can see that there's two different ends on there um so this is so perfect it's super cute it's 256 gigs just like my phone um which is perfect she saved the day with this one i absolutely love it it's super easy to use you connect it into your phone it's all like common sense and self-explanatory so you did the thing with this one girl <laughs> the next thing heather got for me is some lip gloss <laughs> she knows i love my lip gloss this is by lano lips um and this is the strawberry scent this stuff is amazing it's like this thick shiny gloss i really love it i can't get enough of it it's very moisturizing i've never even heard of this brand before um but now that i know about it there's no turning back i'm like obsessed with like moisturizing lip balms lip glosses um and so this will definitely be one of my holy grail items now so the next gift i got from heather is hot sauce <laughs> I know you're like what you got hot sauce as a birthday gift i did and i was like oh this girl knows me like she knows me y'all i love hot sauce i love spicy and this is like first of all it's son of zombie garlic reaper which is carolina reaper and zombie apocalypse what like 
I'm so excited to try this. So we're gonna do a video. I'm holding off. She wants me to taste it now and see if I like it, but I'm waiting. So we're gonna do a video where we're like taste testing these hot sauces. And we're also gonna get some from um, the show Hot Ones. Like when I saw this, I immediately thought of Hot Ones. And if I ever become famous, like I wanna go on Hot Ones. Like I have to, I'm a spicy connoisseur. I love spicy. So I'm like, oh, I wish I could go on Hot Ones. I would freaking kill it. So we're gonna kind of do our own little Hot Ones. Look out for that video, it's coming soon. But this was so perfect for me. Um, I literally can't wait to try it. It actually looks pretty tasty too, just from looking at it. I really can't wait to try the Carolina Reaper, not gonna lie. It looks delicious and there's like garlic. Yeah, so that's that right there. Cute little trio. Um, perfect to put a little hot sauce in your bag swag. You know what I mean? I love this. I love Okay, and my final gift from Heather, she was nice enough to include a gift bag. You have that option when you purchase on Amazon. Um, and it's just so nice. Actually, she included a gift bag for the ring light, I believe, as well. It was a really nice, like, gift bag. Um, same materials as this one. It's very thick. They have the little ribbon on it, and it's tied all pretty in a bow. Um, but, yeah. She knows I'm obsessed with Harry Potter. <laughs> So she got me this really cool mug. Um, first of all, it's huge. It's the Sorting Hat Gryffindor Heat Reveal Mug, 20 ounces. So this thing is like really big and it's a heat revealing design on there. So let me show you what it looks like. Hang on, hang on, hang on. So you have your sorting hat and then when you fill it up with something hot you'll see the gryffindor like logo which is really cute and I, it was funny because when she was thinking of what to get me she would randomly ask me questions and i'm like i know why you're asking me these random questions <laughs> but she's like what house are you in again gryffindor right <laughs> I'm like, yeah i think i'm getting something harry potter but this is okay look how big this mug is can you guys tell it is huge and i love it like this is freaking amazing i can't can't wait to use this i was like dying to film this video just so i can use all my gifts but this is perfect you can never have too many mugs um and i absolutely love it i love it so much i think it's sorry hold on let me put this back so i'm not making noise i think that gift is really cute because like you know with the sorting hat like it takes a while and suddenly your house is revealed so i think it's really cool that it has the hat on there and then on the back your house is revealed it's perfect whoever thought of that genius my next gift is from my other bestie daisha she got me this really cute etsy gift box that i'm going to show you guys now granted i took everything out and like looked through it so it's not as like neatly presented as it was when i first got it but it's this really cute like self-care kind of gift box um so it has this little bath bomb in here which is really nice i've always wanted to use a bath bomb it has this vanilla mint lip balm Again, my girls be knowing I love me some lip balm. It has this really cute candle and it says good vibes only on it. And what's really nice is they included these cute little XOXO matches, which I'm an XO girl. I don't know if you guys ever noticed, but in my description box at the very bottom, I always put XOL. Um, so I'm just an XO girl. <laughs> and then she gave me these lavender and rose Epsom salt. Um, what is this? Bath salts? um and i also got some candy in here some candy and then i got this really cute tumbler which i always wanted one of these first of all the look and the size of it just screams cocktail like i feel like i should only drink cocktails out of this <laughs> but it's so nice because my name is on it with the apostrophe and with the capital s because that is key okay it's crucial um and then it has this like straw this reusable straw that goes with it as well so i thought that was really nice i love that it's white um it's like sleek it's cute it's perfect this is a really nice gift box and i'm going to ask her um, if she doesn't mind telling me I'm gonna try to link this stuff down below the thing is when people get you gifts like you're not supposed to tell them how much you spent so I don't want to be invasive and be like hey can I link it below because then I'm obviously gonna know how much they spent on me um so I'll link down below everything that I can um with the, the permission of my friends <laughs> but yeah I got that cute little gift box from her, which I absolutely love. I thought that was adorable. And honestly, Daisha does an amazing job every year when it comes to giving me birthday gifts because she knows me so well. Okay, so my next gift is from my mommy. Hi, mom. I know you're watching this. Um, the first gift, I'm just going to include a little clip right here of 
all the gifts my mom got me um because the lottery tickets i i don't want to show you i already scratched them they're i have to mail them to her they're already put away um but my mom has this thing with lottery tickets it's her cute little thing she does for holidays and birthdays um so on your birthday you get as many lottery tickets as how old you are um and i didn't get my gift from her last year so that's why there's so many lottery tickets i had to scratch all those bad boys um and i actually won quite a bit of money so that was really cool um and then she got me some cash she always does and it's always appreciated and then she got me these really cute uh well it's like two necklaces and earrings so there's those right there and i've never had diamond anything before so hopefully you guys can see that um and then she got me this one here and this one which is my absolute favorite because it's a heart and i just think it's so cute now we do have a slight problem um i don't know if you guys noticed but i'm a gold girl i always wear gold and the reason i always wear gold is because i'm allergic to sterling silver um so it sucks because I'm low-key willing to catch a rash for it, but my mom's like, no, that's stupid. Just like return it and get something else. But I, they're so cute. I want to keep them. So I'm like, can you grow out of an allergy? Should I try it? Comment down below. Let me know what you think. Because <laughs> I really want to keep them. They're so cute. Um, But yeah, that's what my mom got me for my birthday. I absolutely loved it. And then my next gift is from my sister. My big sister got me this deluxe scratch off world map i didn't even open it yet honestly because i want to get a frame for it kind of i want to figure out how i want to do it because obviously you're going to scratch off as you travel so i want to have it where i can like you know just easily access it oh is it all like wrapped up and stuff i don't want to unravel it too much should i do it for the sake of the video for the sake of the video I'll show y'all a little corner, a little piece, a little piece. Ooh, that is so cute. You see? And then you scratch off where you've been. Uh, this is so adorable and it is perfect. You guys know I'm a flight attendant. This is like the perfect gift for a flight attendant. Um, so yeah i don't know i'm kind of contemplating like maybe getting like a cork board and like tacking it on and then hanging that up so that way i can just scratch without having to like because if i put it in a frame i don't know i'll figure it out but this gift was so perfect it's so cute i honestly like have been wanting something where i can keep track of where i've been um and i didn't even know they they made things like this see now it's, I, i'm not gonna be able to get it back in dang it um but yeah i didn't know they made like little scratch off like maps like that so that's a really really cool idea um and i'm glad she got that for me okay so my next gift is from my friend jessica and when she pulled this out i was like freaking out <laughs> freaking out because it is so cute it's so perfect i've always wanted one but i've always kind of been afraid it's a plant and it's so cute she literally like put these on here obviously it's not gonna come like this but it says abundance for lashara because it is a chinese money tree now it's looking a little scarce because we've had a little issues with it I feel like a failure so <laughs> i say i was always afraid to have a plant because i don't think i have a green thumb like i i know there's like a skill to this that i i don't think i have um and so you know i obviously looked it up because everyone's like how, did you research how to take care of it duh like wh how else was i gonna figure it out but it's not much to it it's a very low maintenance plant the problem is though something fell onto the plant and it knocked it over and two of the branches like snapped and so i had to like cut them off i think i think the plant is trying to like recoup because here's one of the ones i had to like cut off and now it's trying to like regrow i don't know i don't know what i'm doing <laughs> but this is so cute i've always wanted a plant and i know there's like really good benefits to having plants in your home so 
this was a really nice starter plant for me uh, especially because i don't know what i'm doing so because it's so low maintenance it's like perfect a lot of people are like you can't mess it up and i'm like is that a challenge <laughs> but no i'm really obsessed with like taking care of it and i want to see it grow so i'll update you guys um on the progress of my little plant but this gift was so freaking nice I, like i just love it it was perfect so thank you jess okay so from my friend amber hey amber amber got me something that we were actually talking about at her place because i'm like oh i need to get some pots and pans it's a long story but um she went ahead and got it for me before i could even get it for myself this is some good quality cookware guys this is um a ninja what is it shark ninja you can literally put this on like any range it says gas electric glass ceramic induction it's a never stick um it doesn't chip it doesn't stick it doesn't flake it is freaking perfect i'll show you the front of it um it is oven safe dishwasher safe metal utensil safe that's so funny because i was on the phone with her and she was asking me if i used it yet i told her no because i was waiting to film this video but i was asking her about that because i know some pans like when you scrape like it's not safe to do because that stuff can get into your food or something like that but i didn't even notice it said right here metal utensil safe so there's that let me take it out so you guys can kind of see it i already opened it when i was at her place when she gave it to me i just wanted to get a good look at it but it comes with this little lid it's very nice and this thing is heavy look ah, i love getting like grown-up gifts like this you know what i mean and to go along with my cookware, she got me something that obviously I won't stop talking about to people. Harry Potter. <laughs> it's this unofficial Hogwarts for the Holidays cookbook. It's really cool because it's not just like Christmas recipes. They have recipes for all year round. They have winter recipes, summer recipes, drinks for any season. Oh, I didn't even see this. That's really cute. Oh, gill growing weed water. Like a gilly weed. Oh. They have Easter recipes, spring recipes in general. They even have a recipe for a glazed ham. Where was that? Glazed ham. Mm -hmm. There's literally recipes for everything in here. So this is really smart. It's really cute. Look at the Valentine's Day cookies. So cute. So this is really perfect. And not only is it like perfect because I love Harry Potter, but it goes hand in hand with the cookware. So I thought that was really thoughtful. I thought it was really sweet. Amber actually was also nice enough to have me over to her place and she made me cupcakes and she put like a little bow and arrow because I am a Sagittarius. Um, and I had a little birthday girl pin. It was, pr I should have wore it for the video. I'm an idiot. <laughs> I forgot, I meant to do that. When I first got the pin, I'm like, oh, I'll wear it in my video. And then I forgot, crap, it's all right. I'm the birthday girl, y'all know it. Okay, so last but certainly not least, you know your girl Sade pulled through for the kid. Sade got me some really cute gifts. All right, so let's start with this one first. She got me some jewelry and it is the tree of life. So cute. I first um, saw like the tree of life on the Alex and Ani website and I read the description and I was like, oh my God, that's so perfect. It's like about growth and evolving and all that stuff, which I love. And what's funny is this is sterling silver too. <laughs> Your girl's just gonna get a rash. It is what it is. You know, it's nothing a little ointment can't fix. It'll be fine. Um, but it's really, really cute. I wanna wear it so bad. She said she's gonna like check and see if she can find it in gold somewhere else, but if not, I'm keeping it. <laughs> so my next gift, the Sagittarius book, you guys, I'm really into astrology and I'm really, really into being a Sagittarius. I feel like it describes me so perfectly. Um, of course, there's your moon sign, there's your rising, and all of that matters as well. But I'm a Sagittarius to the core through and through. And she got me this book. It says, The Art of Living Well and Finding Happiness According to Your Star Sign. Um, this book is actually really amazing. I read like about four or five chapters so far. And I was like, whoa. Now, granted, because I do look up my sign and I'm so into it, there's some things in here that I did already know. But there's also some things that I'm like... Oh, you reading me. I'm supposed to be reading you, but you reading me. I've never had a book read me like this before. <laughs> this is amazing. It was like, what was that part I read? It was your star sign secrets. And I was like, 
oh y'all real loud you're you're loud and i need you to pipe down because you're loud <laughs> like this book is really really good so i can't wait to finish reading it this was absolutely perfect for me um so thank you so much for that Shade. and then look how cute she knows I started journaling and I'm like obsessed with it now. And so she got me this really, really pretty journal. Hold on, let me take it out of the, the plastic. I kept it in here because I don't want it to get ruined. So I'm going to leave it in here until it's time for me to use it. I still have another journal I need to finish. But let me show you what this looks like. Doesn't this look like a limited edition? Like, like just a book that's like hard to find. Like, look at the freaking what? And then it has the gold lined pages. Oh my God, what what is going on here? And she, know, she knows I love purple. And if I could show you the rest of my room, you'd see purple all over the place. I mean, look at my robe right here. She knows how I feel about purple. <laughs> and so she got me this purple and gold journal and it's so nice. Like it is low key, it's so nice. I don't wanna write in it. I will, but um, I'm gonna have to use special pens for this journal. <laughs> I'm so dramatic, but I'm dead serious. I'm <laughs> getting me some really nice pens <laughs> to write in this journal. Like, this is so beautiful. I feel like I wanna be intentional about what I write in here. Like, I only wanna write positive things in this journal or like write my goals or something. I don't know, but it's, it's gotta be special. It does have the, um, what is this thing called again? The ribbon bookmark. It does have a ribbon bookmark which i absolutely love um so you can easily find where you left off at but this was really special like this is i wish you guys can feel it too it's like really smooth and soft like oh, it's just a gorgeous journal okay i'm sorry i'm like obsessing over a book but i love books i've always been a bookworm especially because the smell of them oh my god i'm done i'm done i know you guys are sick of me okay so that is it for all of my birthday gifts but i got a bonus for you hold please what is this and where did this come from <laughs> wait what is this did this fall out of the book oh i think this fell wait what oh this fell out of the the scratch off map I didn't even know this was in here. So this is the little thing you used to scratch. I don't know what this is. It's rubber, feels like an eraser. This one says do something awesome every single day. Um, and then this has little stickers on it. Interesting. Okay, okay, okay. But what is this for? Oh, this is a ruler? I don't know why, but I'm gonna have to figure this stuff out. Okay, I just noticed this on the floor and I was like, where did that come from? Whoops. Okay, so we're back around to Heather. Heather got me a Christmas gift and it was so cute and perfect. I had to share it with you guys. So I'm like, you know what? I'm just gonna go ahead and include it in my birthday haul video. Isn't it so perfect? It's a Sagittarius. It has moonstone in it. It is believed to give off energies of luck, power, healing, and love. Simply keep moonstone with you in order to allow it to in influence your vibrational energy. Clear quartz, known as a master healer, and will amplify energy and thought, as well as the effect of other crystals. Amethyst is a natural tranquilizer. It reveals, sorry, relieves stress and strain, soothes irritability, balances mood swings, dispels anger, rage, fear, and anxiety. Um, so here are my little crystals. Just so cute. And then it also, first of all, this is so cute too. Look at this. Mm, so cute. It has this little uh, candle in it, and it says Sagittarius on it, enthusiastic, colorful, adventurous, you know, just a couple, you know, adjectives. And then inside, look, 
It's so pretty. So this box she got me is the floral box, but that's not the box she intended to get me. Uh, there was another box that the seller sold. It was like a sage box because she knows I've been dying to sage. Like I keep talking about, I need to sage, I need to sage. And so she got me a box that had sage in it, but the seller accidentally sent the wrong one. So they're sending me the sage now. But um, yeah, that's why everything in here is like all floral themed because this is the floral box. Um, it also has this oil in it, like this body oil. It's just like a floral scent. But that's really cute there and then it has these floral um bath salts as well so that was really really nice and it has all these cute little flowers in here look and you know how i feel about purple so yeah look at that so so cute this was so nice to get for christmas thank you again so much heather you know me too well back up back up you know me a little bit too well now <laughs> But yeah, I just wanted to share that with you guys because I absolutely adore all of my gifts. I think they're perfect. I think it shows how well the people in my life know me um, and how well they pay attention to me. Um, and obviously this year was tough for everybody and I'm really big on birthdays, especially my own. <laughs> so my friends and my family showing me love through all these gifts really made me feel special for my birthday i just wanted to make this video to show some appreciation and to also for my subscribers maybe you see something that you want or gives you ideas for gifts or whatever the case may be like i said i will link everything down below um if i can if my friends don't mind um and if not i'm sure you guys can do a quick google search and find everything i showed you but thank you so much for watching um oh i almost forgot how did i forget I want to say thank you to each and every one of you for subscribing to my channel. I have 110 subscribers when I broke 100. That was the most amazing feeling ever. And I know like I have a long way to go, but 100 subscribers is still really special to me. I don't promote my channel at all. I don't promote it on Instagram, Twitter, nowhere really. I'll have the link in my bio, but I don't ever really promote my channel. And so the fact that I still managed to get 110 subscribers, I'm really proud of myself. And I love that you guys keep coming back. I love that you click that subscribe button because you're interested in what I have to say and what I show you and the information that I share. Um, so it just it just really gives me like the energy and the drive to just keep going because I know somebody likes it. Um, so I just wanted to say thank you guys so much. I was so freaking excited when I got the notification. Um, and yeah, I'm, I'm going to be more consistent. I promise. Now I have a ring light, so I have no excuse. <laughs> but yeah, thank you again for watching and I hope to see you next time. Bye.